Hello, welcome to some all kind TV. Please subscribe and share to bless someone. In today's um, video, I'm going to show you how you can use WordPress to design a website or a blog. You can start design website for clients and and make money out of it. You can design website for your own personal company, your personal blog, or you can design website for any other purpose. Now we are going to use a powerful content management application system called WordPress to install. But most often, many don't have money to buy a web hosting account or domain name to start designing a website. So in this screen, I'm going to show you how you can install a WordPress easily on your own local computer, your computer in the house. Then you can be designing, practicing how to design your website on your computer at home. So uh, before you you get money in future, then you can upload your files through Fizella onto your web host account. But for now, let's start the training and learn something and start learn how to design a website in your own house on your own computer. WordPress is a powerful content application system that it's used to design website. It powers over seventy five million website on the internet so we are going to use a simple method now go to bitnami.com b-i-t-n-a-m-i.com now when the website opens to bitnami.com click on the product menu here and click on the sub menu application catalog now we have various applications here that we we you can use to install on your computer and start using them to design a website we have Jomla they are all, most of them are content applications software we have rubies on rails Drupa we have PrestaShop cube apps media wiki a lot a lot of apps here but we are going to use WordPress because WordPress is very popular it's very robust dynamic it can design a whole lot of professional website so now click on the WordPress here. Now what we are going to do is we are going to store it on my computer, not on the cloud, not on containers, but on my computer. So now in this section here, look for this button, Windows or Mac or Linux and click on it. Now scroll down to your page, you see the various download installers for Windows, Apple and Linux. We are using Windows PC right now. So we are going to install it on our Windows computer. Now click on it. It will start downloading. Now I've already logged into Bitnami. So you see here, I've logged in. So it did not ask me for my email. If you are a first time user, it will prompt you to enter your email before the downloads pops up. So now let's save our file. We are waiting for our file to be saved here. We are using Firefox browser here so you can see that it's downloading. If you are using our uh, Google Chrome browser, it's downloading down here. So we wait for the download to complete. Now let's see if the download is complete. Now it's complete. We click on it. It says Vietnamese WordPress 5.222 installer. So click on it like this to launch the installer so we click on it and we wait for the installation to start it says okay the prompt up here is now accept agreements that pops up i click yes then i wait for the next installation to continue now it asks for the language that I want my installation to be in i'm using english so i'll you can choose various language but i'll use english so i set it okay now it says welcome to Vietnam WordPress stack setup wizard go to next now here is asking to install WordPress and PHP my admin so leave it intact leave the box intact like this because we are going to use the PHP my admin to it to be creating our databases in the PHP my admin so just go to next here now it says select the folder to install the WordPress the default folder is a C bit NAMI, so we just leave it like this in our C drive. Then we click next. It's asking for the next section here, our name. So we give it, you enter your name. 
then you enter your email enter your email that you want to register on WordPress so enter your email here then your login remember to write this detail down before you 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 enter them so that you not forget because you'll be needing them you'll be needing them to log into your WordPress dashboard now let's enter our password now the password section requires you to enter alphanumeric num alf alphabetic mixed with numbers so alphanumeric you can enter mix up alf alphabets and numbers so now these are my details that i'll be using right now after this section i click on next now it says please configure your block name your wordpress name or your block name so i'll write how to design a website there's a sample uh, title I'm giving to the blog or website name so that is all then click on the next section is it's asking you to configure mail support don't do anything there just go to next now it says Bitnami Simplify is a way popular server application deployment stacks are created and deployed in the cloud with a million deployment each month Bitnami has become the world's most popular destination for deploying today's most popular open source application launch wordpress in the cloud with bitnami so this section here you can skip it we we can you can check it because we are going to launch our wordpress on our local computer we are not going to launch it in the cloud so you can check it like this and you click next so now the process starts to install the application on our computer it says click next again so we wait for the installation to prepare itself and unpack files so it takes a little bit of time so you can wait whilst the files are unpacked onto your local machine You can design various websites with uh, WordPress, professional WordPress content management website, web development. WordPress is very robust. It has a very easy interface that you can use to start learning how to design a website. If you become a professional in web design, you can even start design website for clients and making money out of it as your second part-time income generating business opportunity there are various blog on the internet now you can even start your own blog and writing good quality articles and monetizing your blog so that you can generate revenue as a part-time income never waste your time ne never be idle learn something today because information is the power to is the powerhouse of this modern age information is really making a lot of impact in our generation now information is the key to greater wealth so it's, it's installing. I'm waiting for the installation to complete for the purpose of this training. It takes a little bit of time, but you, you have to wait. You have to wait for the installation complete. Now this process is very easy and very automated. It doesn't require you to know PHP. It doesn't require you to know uh, MySQL. It doesn't require you to know various uh, coding and integration because without this simple installation process installing a WordPress on your local machine requires you to do some a little bit configuration you have to know a little bit of my SQL database config configuration how you configure your my PHP admin and how you can also uh, 
unzip all the WordPress files it, it is very hard if you are not a uh, very good learner it will take you a whole lot of uh, complex process and if you make a mistake in configuring your database also you can <laughs> lose all your files or you cannot even start or launch the WordPress but with this process is very easy it's just a click and follow the process like this uh, your installation will complete for you all your databases will be created you know the username we entered and the password and the email will be used to automatically configure and create your database on your local machine so if you don't have money to buy a hosting account to launch your site immediately you can start using this method to install the WordPress application files on your computer and also start practicing it at home when you are free you can practice how to design the website because if you don't have money you cannot uh, buy a hosting account a hosting account requires a bit of some capital injection where you have to pay to a host company to buy you a domain name and a host where the WordPress files will be installed and you can remotely launch onto your hosting control panels and start designing your website so but for the purpose of this training as a beginner you don't have all those money just install it on your local machine and start design they asked me to uh, allow my SQL so if you have this prompt I just allow it allow it because it will be creating the database my SQL on your local machine so allow allow it on your local machine so we wait for the various backend configurations are being done this one it doesn't need a lot of uh, knowledge or coding to you just wait uh, all the configuration is is being installed at the back end the bias 12 are uh, all databases are all installed at the back end of the screen so you just see this instant interface like this all you have to do is just be accepting and follow the next prompts and it it will complete your installation for you so like I was saying that if you don't have money to start buying a host or a domain you can start with this but if you want to also buy a host and a domain name and start from the onset to design your blog or launch your website in the description of this video you can see my contact and email here contact me I'll put a link where you can also buy a host company at a cheap price if you want to start hosting directly remotely now it says apache http server we have to also accept so whatever pops up on your screen accept because it's installing the backend application for the mysql and apache uh, service so we wait for the installation it's taking a little bit of time but you have to wait for it because we really need the software that is WordPress on our local machine. We are assuming we don't have money to buy a hosting company now. So we have to wait for the application to complete. Now then we can start practicing design. After even you design your website on your local machine, you can export it later if you have money to buy the hosting. You export all your files onto your hosting server and you are done that is all so in sub uh, future training videos I'll show you how you export the files if you are designing in your local machine onto a web server or a web host if you're able to buy in future so now it says setup has finished installing launch Bitnami WordPress stack so finish 
now we wait to launch it it says finish so now it has installed in our local system now it says away so wordpress is now installed access west wordpress so now you see there's your local ip your local computer ip so we did not buy any host we just click access click the access wordpress so now it says this is our wordpress hello world <laughs> it has installed perfectly now when it installs there's two options you can do you can log in using this metadata here or you can also look at this uh, look at this address this is your local IP your local computer so you can also copy this and paste it in a notepad you can copy this like this and open a notepad like this and paste it and save it you can paste it so that anytime this will be your login address even if you forget you, you know 127.0.0.1 slash wordpress slash wp slash login.php so this will be your login address so remember this one so that anytime you start your computer in the house you have to so this this is going to be your web 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 address your local computer web address because now you don't have any hosting account so so now it's asking for our username so the username that we created during the installation remember i told you remember to write it down so that you don't forget if you forget you are in trouble you cannot log in so that's the username i chose and the password so i click login it says do i want to save no don't save now you see perfectly our wordpress is installed now this is our wordpress dashboard perfect 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 installation so i'll just continue by showing how you can just create a simple uh a simple website Let, let's start to just install a simple team like this go to the appearance section here you have team so click now the default team is 2019 it, it doesn't look very good for me so i'll just click on add new team then i'll go to the wordpress team section i can be adding various teams so let's let let's see if i install this steam onto our dashboard here if there are various teams here you can go to you can upload your own team or you can so after clicking the install i click on activate my team now the team activates it says visit site so let let us look at how our site is now looking just right click here right click on the link here and open link in new window so we'll see how our website is looking it doesn't look really good but because there's a default section so i'm going to do some configuration and now we are going to see how the site will be looking now let's do some quick quick uh, configuration here on the left section here on your widget i'm going to remove all this widget is making my site look awful so i'll just remove all these widgets here now i'll just customize click on the customize section here uh i want to do some simple configuration here we have header we don't have header images you have the home page section you can i can set it to a static page here like this sample page um i can add you can add a new page like there's um services you can add various pages uh contact we are just creating simple simple pages for the purpose of this training so i just after creating just publish it like this now let's see how so that let me preview again how my site will be looking now you see i'm on it <laughs> i'm just creating 
a simple website like this so so this is how it is now in this training I'll show you how we can create nice website we can create powerful website even let me show you one last section here then we just close for this training today I load a team that I have on my computer like this so click on team let me look for a nice team uh, I click on add a team then I want to upload a team that I have on my computer so click on upload and click on the browser here so I just click on the browser here I have some team here uh, I will just be going through some section of some themes that I have um, uh, I will see I have some team here in my document uh, let me see if I have some team oh, SKT okay I'll be just adding some let me choose any team like business consultant or yeah so after uploading any team that you have you have downloaded on your computer you can install it manually activate it so after activating let me preview it and see so right click on the preview section here and let's see how our team wow this is very nice you see um so the you can do a lot of a whole lot of configuration this we can edit this to whatever we want you can click add information but in future videos i'll show you how you can be creating your con your pages your posts i'll show you a whole lot of but this training we are ending to for now so this is a simple a simple nice uh so now you see i'm running this wordpress on my local computer on my machine i'm not running it on a domain name i'm not running it in any web host because i don't have money now to buy a host i'm assuming like you don't have money now to buy a web host or a domain name so you can start practice this practicing it in your own room you can use this wordpress it's very powerful to it has very robust section you can do any and there are various plugins that you can use to design various any any customization that you want to make so thank you very much and in future videos i'll show you how to create contact form how to create forms how to create uh slideshow animations how to create professional animations how to create our uh, blog post how to create a whole lot of so for this training we are done have a wonderful day and please subscribe to this channel some okay subscribe and continue to share to bless someone have a wonderful day